Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can transfer all your personal pr settings, all your files, music, movies, programs and games from your old Macintosh computer to your brand new computer. It doesn't have to be an iMac, it could also be a MacBook. Actually I'm transferring this time from a MacBook Pro to my new iMac. So what I've done, there are many possible ways to do it, but I'm using my time capsule. I'm always making time capsules anyways to back up. So I'm going to use migration tools. Migration assistant. I'm going to run it. Continue. And I'm gonna choose from a Mac, Time Machine, Backup, or Startup Disk. Continue. It's searching and it's finding my external hard drive, which is my time capsule. And it's trying to find other sources, but it's not gonna find anything else. You can also transfer uh, by using a Thunderbolt cable, which is also very simple and it's the same way to do it. But since I don't have a Thunderbolt cable and I already am using a time capsule, then I might as well just use my time capsule. You can also use Migration Assistant when you're setting up your new Mac computer for the very first time. But I chose to just go into it and install the new uh, Mavericks on my brand new computer right away. Okay, so you don't have to wait at all, you just press your time capsule, press continue, and my latest backup, which is a few days ago, but still <laughs> haven't used my MacBook Pro since then. Okay, and I want applications, I want my documents, my data, my computer and network settings. I want it all. You can, if you don't want your applications or your documents and data that include not only documents but also your movies and iTunes songs and stuff. And I'm pressing replace uh, my Stephen Sonogar account on my computer because I don't want to have two accounts anyways. So this is how you do it and normally it takes between an hour or two hours or so I imagine. So I'm gonna get, get back to this. Migration complete and time four hours, four, four and a half hour. Restart. And my good old login.
it's almost ready for use and <clears throat> you may or may have not noticed before the migration everything was set up for English now it's set up for Danish because it's the new account or rather it's not the new account it's the old account from my old notebook which was on Danish so I have my games down here and all my stuff and I also have iBooks which is new because I didn't have Mountain Lion I only had Lion on my old MacBook Pro and I still have all my games and programs and I'm sure I have some music somewhere too. Alright, thanks for watching and 